a build guide that's on their website, and the first thing it suggests is to keep track of the screws. So, got that. And then the next thing we're going to do is take this apart. But first, we're going to go get our glass. Fortunately, as I've gotten older, it's gotten harder for me to see stuff up close. So, I need a uh, good set of glasses in order to be able to see stuff. So, I think these are the screws that have to come out to get in. And of course there's a security screw there. We'll figure out what that is in a minute. <laughs> wouldn't be a consumer product if they didn't try to make it difficult to get into. I will tell you guys what it is once I figure it out, but until then I don't want to speculate. So, it has a hole in the middle, and it is hex-shaped on the outside. Not sure those will be making a return trip, but for now... is complete without a surprise and this surprise lives under the feet Uh, but only the funniest will do. It's 
definitely an engineered product. are like razors and that's normal for sheet metal all right so now that we're in we're gonna do a little uh, EEV blog look and see so they did bother to do that they did earth ground it well uh, that's even got some sharp edge protection yeah that's shitty that's shitty Oh, isn't that cute? A little mechanical bell. I will say that on the scale of things, this probably will last quite a while. This is not a bad made oven other than that's shitty and that's shitty. So let's see what the instructions tell us to do next. Pretty sure the next step is to give it a lobotomy. Yep. So, we need to give it a lobotomy. And the easiest way to do that is right here. So... Disconnect the connectors. I really could use a pair of needle nose. Let me get this. Alright, so the needle nose will make much shorter work of this. here that need to be cut. And I don't think we'll be needing this anymore, but I'm going to pull it out until I can make that decision later. Well, it looks like they got rid of the that I'm not looking for one. Yeah, it might be easier if my desk was not junky, 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 but get over it. A clean desk is a sign of someone who doesn't really have very much to do. Look, 
it's a second pair of numbers. So, next. We'll just get under here and get this knob ready for recycling. Away it goes. All right. And that is sharp, so be careful. And we're going to send that to recycling as well. It's actually a very nice little mechanical um, temperature sensor, but I guess it relies on the heat in this little control area, which would be hideously stupid. All right, let's see how far down this goes. we need is a picture of the front of the oven to see if they left any controls on it whatsoever. Yeah, he left the bottom two knobs on. All right. So the next thing we need to do is seal the oven. And let me study this. Oh, wait, there's more. Apparently there are air gaps back here, so we need to pull this thing completely apart. Which, trust me, isn't much further. interesting. So the old build used to not apparently used to be another piece in here apparently. No, that can't be right. I see what he's doing. So that's just a temporary staycation. Now be mindful that this thing is sharper than you can possibly imagine. And there is a wire that goes over here, here, here. So that's the circuit. It's a nice, simple little circuit. All right, 